All righty, Chef Buck here. And today we're cooking up a decadent, delectable, awesome spaghetti carbonara. If you've never tried carbonara, you know, definitely give this a go. It's luscious, you're gonna love it. Get a little Pecorino Romano, rate that up. You know, we're gonna use about a half a cup. I'm actually gonna use a little bit more than that. Then I'm gonna use three egg yolks, just the yolks, three, and then one entire egg. You wanna whip those eggs up together and go ahead and add your cheese into there. Now use about a half a cup of cheese, but really I'm using about three quarters a cup because I'm going cheese crazy today. You know, so this mixture is going to be really kind of thick. And look how yellow that is, you know, but that's the way it's going to look because we're using mostly yolks. But that's really what's going to make this dish so delicious and creamy. Use some pancetta if you got it, but I'm, I'm going to try some thick sliced bacon. I got a local farm around here and this bacon's already peppery. And you know, pepper is a big part of this dish and this bacon is thick. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut that up and use this here. If you use some pancetta, whatever you use, you want it to be nice and thick and cubed. Now fix your spaghetti up according to the package directions and just put a little bit of salt in there. Not a whole lot, cause you know the cheese is gonna have salt in it and you know the, the bacon's gonna have salt in it. So you don't need a lot of extra salt in this dish. Get your skillet heated up and we'll go ahead and start working on this bacon and getting that cooked up. And if you wanted to, you could put a little bit of onion and garlic in here too, but we're making kind of a, a classic, you know, semi-classic carbonara, so we're gonna leave that out today. But what you do wanna put in is pepper, and all the pepper you can handle. This bacon's already got pepper in it, but I'm still throwing some more pepper on here. So, you know, carbonara is all about the pepper. Now we wanna cook our bacon all up. We wanna cook it through, but we don't want it to be crispy. You know, definitely don't want it to be crispy but you're gonna to wanna to pour off some of that bacon grease there at the end when you're just about ready to finish because you're not gonna want all that grease there. You don't have to be militant about getting out of the pan. A little bit of that's gonna be great flavor, but you know, strain that and then your pasta should be ready. And then we'll just go ahead and dip our pasta out of this pan and throw it right in our skillet there. Now don't drain or rinse your pasta or anything. Just throw it right in there, swish it around, get it mixed in with this meat, get all these flavors all throughout this pasta, you know, and you want to do that before you put your sauce in there because you want to put your sauce on top of this pasta and meat. Don't throw your sauce into the skillet with the bacon because you don't want scrambled eggs, man. You want sauce. You want a nice creamy egg sauce. So go ahead and pour that on top, you know, get it all in there. Now mine's really kind of thick because I got all this cheese in there, but that's fine because what we're going to do is we're going to work it through, you know, we're going to swish it in, swirl it all around, and it's going to produce this wonderful, creamy, delicious egg sauce. And if you've never had it, you know, you got to try it. This is such an awesome flavor. It's going to be so creamy, but we're not putting any cream in it. And if you wanted to, you could put a little bit of fresh parsley in here, you know, for a little bit of color. That's up to you. But man, look at this. It's just fantastic. And then that's it. You're good to go. You can go ahead and plate this up, throw it out there for the public, man, and they are going to love you. Spaghetti carbonara. It's awesome. So go ahead and give it a try. Let me know what you think. And bon appetit. Alrighty, thanks for uh, checking out the video. If you make it, I hope you like it. Uh, you know, stop and smell the uh, roses and uh, smile at strangers.